So I think the big news that uh, come out recently was uh, that Dave Lorty stopped by spring training. How did that come about? And uh, what's happened with him stopping by? Yeah, he uh, they kind of had planned that he was going to be coming. Um, since I think that they sent uh, maybe it was a press release last uh, September, kind of talking about his um, like new role with the team as a as a special assistant. Uh, so last year, obviously, he didn't come because it was the first year after. Um, retirement and he didn't really want to uh, interact too much, kind of interfere with things. Uh, so he kind of stayed away a little bit uh, then. Uh, but this year he's kind of in camp helping out. He knows J.D. Martinez a little bit, kind of help him with um, just kind of the transition at DH um, and, and those kind of things. So, uh, yeah, I mean, obviously it'll be a big ask to have around. He played with Cora. They know each other. And that's kind of been a thing Cora's been doing is bringing in these guys that aren't on the coaching staff. Um, but are, uh, you know, obviously extremely accomplished players like Mike Lowell and, and Derek Lowe is here um, to kind of help the guys out. So is this more in line with what you think his David Ortiz's long-term relationship with the Red Sox is going to be like? Because he had a bunch of business ventures last year was kind of away from the team. Do you think he's going to be doing a lot more of this down the road? Um, maybe eventually. It doesn't sound like he's too keen on being around a lot. Like, he kept saying he's going to be busy the rest of the month and that he probably won't see the team again until uh, they get back to the park. So I think he's really enjoying retirement, kind of all the different things that he has going on. It doesn't, he said he is going to be here this weekend, but it doesn't really sound like he wants to be around too, too much in terms of on the field. Um, I think eventually he will, but I think he's kind of enjoying all these other event, uh, kind of uh, endeavors that he has uh, going on right now. But yeah, I mean, like, like Pedro Martinez does, where he kind of pops in and out over the course of the year. I could see him doing something like that, but I don't see him kind of being like an everyday presence or, you know, uh, being around. He moved. He used to live. He just moved down to Miami from Boston. He had stayed in Boston, so he's not um, he's not up there full time anymore. Um, so uh, he'll be around, but I, I don't think he's gonna. It's gonna be like a, uh, I don't know, you know, a, another coach on the staff type thing.